relevant to the comment that I made earlier of where if, you know, if something moves, we regulate it. If it's still moving, we tax it. And if it dies when it stops moving, then we subsidize it. Mr. Speaker, we've had long, extensive cons uh, conversations about increasing the tourism, uh, the, the TAT. We've, we've talked about um, the whole host of regulations. We, we, we have taxed and regulated an industry that we're starting to see die. And now we're having to step in after we, we soak them and squeeze them for every penny we can get out of them. Then we have to come back in and in order to save the industry, we say, oh, oh my goodness, we have to give these guys tax credit or we're looking at a plateauing industry that's, that, that's not gonna survive. Uh, Mr. Speaker, I'm pretty sure back in the day, they never thought that, that sugarcane would go away. They probably thought that pineapple would never go away. Mr. Speaker, tourists can go away. If we're not more careful in the way which we approach this, we're already starting to see, now we're in the phase of, well, it's, kind of looks, it's slowing down, it looks like it might stop moving, so we gotta start subsidizing it. If we're not careful, Mr. Speaker, we're gonna, we're gonna hurt 175,000 people who work in this industry, and we're starting to see some of the fruits of over-regulation and over-taxation, Mr. Speaker. But for those reasons, I, I'm still supportive of helping the industry stay on its feet. Thank you very much, Representative. Further